Welcome back to the show. We're going to talk about osteoarthritis now with Dr. Ricardo Colbert. He's back today. He practices at the Pelham branch of the Andrews Sports Medicine and Orthopedic Clinic. Good morning. Good morning, Evan. Uh, so uh, tell us about osteoarthritis. So osteoarthritis is a condition that affects millions of people around the world. Uh, basically, we're talking about wearing of the cartilage in, in our joints. Um, it can affect any joints, the knees, the hips, uh, the back. Um, in fact, it's the number one cause of disability in the United States. Is there a cure for it? So unfortunately, there's no cure for osteoarthritis. According to the Arthritis Foundation, the number one recommendation or treatment for preventing osteoarthritis from happening is to stay active, working out and staying, you know, maintaining a, a healthy lifestyle, healthy weight. Um, now at Andrew Sports Medicine, we do offer multiple treatment options uh, for patients that do develop arthritis. Um, some of them are more in the conservative treatment and some others are more in the, uh, uh, the latest technology that's been uh, published. And well, let's talk about some of those treatment options because one of them is regenerative, regenerative medicine. Explain that to us. So regenerative medicine is a new field that has been introduced um, for the treatment of multiple orthopedic conditions, including osteoarthritis. Basically, it entails trying to restore the natural environment of the joint. Uh, we use uh, the body's own healing capacity uh, to stimulate that healing. Uh, we can also use medications that stimulate uh, or nourish the joint. Um, it's a great option for uh, young patients uh, within their you know, 30 to 40 years mm -hmm. of age that are having conditions uh, or having early onset of arthritis and are failing the conservative treatment options. You know, we typically do uh, prescription anti-inflammatories, physical therapy and injections. And when those treatments are not providing the patient significant relief, we look at regenerative medicine options. And uh, one of those, um, is this a gel shot? So the gel shot is the, uh, the first generation uh, within regenerative medicine. Um, it was introduced about 15 years ago and it's called hyaluronate. Mm -hmm. It's basically, it's a synthetic version of our joint fluid. We inject it okay. into the joint, it decreases friction, decreases pain, and allows the patient to return to their activities. How long will that last? I mean, we have to get it replaced at some point or? The gel shot on average will give the patient significant relief for about six months if they have significant arthritis. Now we do get a lot of patients that get gel shots and they get up to three years relief and they do great. What about platelet-rich plasma? So platelet-rich plasma is the second generation of regenerative medicine. It was introduced uh, between five to ten years ago and basically we take the patient's own blood, we extract the growth factors in the stem cells from your blood that stimulate healing and we inject that into the injured tissue. So it's the same way when you cut your skin and you bleed, 12 weeks later you get new skin that grows and that's because the, uh, the platelets in our, in our blood stimulate the skin to grow. So we can actually stimulate the joint uh, to heal injecting uh, the PRP into the body. It's a safe procedure. Um, it's from your own blood so there's minimal risk of complications. And also, uh, there was one more that I wanted to ask you about, but the technology has increased so much. Yeah. So you're able to detect it earlier and treat it, I guess, better. So the technology has advanced quite a bit in terms of the diagnosis and the treatment options. Uh, early recognition is key, and that's one of the things that we emphasize at Andrews, so we can prevent complications later on in life and allow people to live a healthy lifestyle. See, so one of the uh, latest treatments that we've been uh, using lately, uh, Dr. Dugas, one of my colleagues, spoke about it a few months ago. Mm -hmm. It's what's called bone marrow concentrate therapy. So this is actually the richest environment in our body where the richest source of growth factors in stem cells is found inside our pelvis, inside the pelvic bone or the bone marrow. Um, and what we do is we harvest a small amount of the bone marrow and we get a concentrate that is very rich in growth factors in stem cells. Uh, we get up to 15 times as many growth factors as the number blood. And then we go ahead and inject that into the injured tissue so we can stimulate again the healing of that tissue and, and the regeneration of that tissue. So there's a paradigm shift in terms of treatment that we're going away from just minimizing pain to actually stimulating the tissue to heal. And so that's a service that we've been offering at Andrews in the last few years. How can people get in touch with you and possibly make an appointment? 
So feel free to look up uh, our website at andrewsportsmedicine.com. Uh, you can also reach us by phone at 205-939-3699. We'd be more than happy to talk to you about all these treatment options. That's awesome. That Thank you. you. Really kind of try to fix it. Yes, it's, it's a great option, especially for the young uh, population, but we also do it for the elderly as well um, that may not qu uh, qualify for uh, total knee or total hip replacement. Um, so this is a great option for those cases. AndrewsSportsMedicine.com for more information. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ebony. All right, we'll be right back with more talk of Alabama.